pay the bills. That's not right. You cast yourself on the campaign trail as a truth seller. You say we need yeah. to tell truths. Yeah. Um, what do you say, or let, uh, tell me if you think this is fair, that as you talk to Democratic voters, they're hungry. Mm -hmm. uh, and they want ideas. Mm -hmm. And so you'll hear things like the Green New Deal. You'll yeah. hear things like uh, yeah. Medicare for All. Uh, you'll hear things like you know, whether it's taxes. You'll hear things. Right. Uh, at what point do you say, that's our North Star, but we have to be realists? We, there's no question we have to be practical. But being practical also recognizes that climate change is an existential threat to us as human beings. Being practical recognizes that greenhouse gas emissions are threatening our, our, our air and it, it threatening the planet and that it is well within our capacity as human beings to change our behaviors in a way that we can reduce its effects. That's practical. Can we afford it? Of course we can afford it. Two and a half, three trillion dollars a year for Medicare for all by some studies. I don't, depending on which portions of the Green New Deal you pick to do first, that's money. Uh, that you know what the Republicans are going to say, tax and spend liberals, pie in the sky. One of the things that I admire and respect is the measurement that is captured in three letters, ROI. Mm -hmm. What's the return on the investment? People in the private sector understand this really well. It's not about a cost, it's about an investment. And then the question should be, is it worth the cost in terms of the investment potential? Are we going to get back more than we put in? So when you Mayor invest, Bloomberg, well, Amy Klobuchar... Some of your potential fellow Democrats say, no, it's too much, it's too ambitious, it's too expensive. You think they're wrong. I look forward to that debate on the debate stage. I look forward to it very much.